Breaking news this hour, Carlton have completed a triple signing, and mostly, it's considered strange. They're three equally worse players. Introducing the first one, who's uh, been known for his poor performances of late, it's Will, isn't it? Will, congratulations, welcome to Colleton. The second signing the uh, Collitons, the Colleton, Collitonians have made is well, someone with electric pace, but often that underpins his use, uselessness in front of goal, really. It's Barney St. Anton. Barney, how do you feel to be at Colleton now? Amazing. Amazing, right, go stand over there. <laughs> and thirdly, a ginger person who likes to run into goalposts <laughs> is Duncan Bradshaw Smith. Hi Duncan, Hi. you happy to be at Colton? Yeah, very happy. Why did you leave your last club? What did you feel was wrong? Well, I just wanted to further my career, really. I wanted to play international football, and this was the chance. Okay, thank you very much. You can stand over there with the other signings. These are, they'll be hoping to play international football for England soon. <laughs> this is Sky Sports and use more on this, uh, more on this in the hour coming. <laughs> Hi, we're back and we're still in the Colton Leisure Centre and we've got one of the new signings with us, I'm delighted to say, Barnes and Anton. So, Barney, how do you feel about playing for this amazing club? Um, uh, pretty privileged at the moment, yeah. So, you enjoy, you're still enjoying your football? Still yeah. looking for the, to play for international level? Uh, yeah, in the next three years, maybe. So, how do you feel about playing football for this club? Well, I tell you what, if I played football like I do women, I'd score all the time. Fantastic. This is Sky Sports News. Due to these brilliant summer signings, we decided in a brand new Ledger facility at Colleton, to find out where, what people's interests are and whether they think that leisure is a luxury or necessity. We've had a top, top undercover agent to find these things out from people. Here he is. He's called um, Crystal Ball. His, his job is to find out whether people believe leisure is a luxury or necessity and what their, where their interests lie. And boy, are we going to find out. Our top secret agent, Mohammed, is now going to explain to us the definition of leisure. Go, Mohammed. Leisure or free time is a period of time spent out of work and essential domestic activity. It's also the period of recreational and discretionary time before or after compulsory activities such as attending school and doing homework. What do you, what do, you do for leisure? I masturbate 24-7. <laughs> Shut up, Tates! So, then, so Tates, how important is leisure to you? Very important. I couldn't function with that. Okay, so we're now back with Rory and Robbie. So guys, what kind of leisure activities do you do in your spare time? Nothing really. Really? Do you not do a lot? No. I really just sit down and watch the and eat salty snacks. <laughs> and you, Robbie? Why don't you go to the gym? I'm pretty sure you do. Every now and then, Robbie, what do you do? I really go to the gym. I used to play quite a lot of tennis, but not anymore. <laughs> yeah, you do. Um, no, a little bit of tennis, a little bit of football, everything I can here and there. Good stuff. And do you go and hit him because he's a bit of a lazy type. Do you guys do you guys think that they should have the exercise bikes? Do you think <laughs> it's a necessity? Really? Yes. Because if you don't do it, you get a fit. That's true. If you get a fit, then you get fat. Did you say sport or leisure? <laughs> if you get sport or leisure, you get <laughs> leisure, you get <laughs> sport. Easy, <don't. laughs> So unless you want to die, do exercise. So Tash, what kind of leisure activities do you involve yourself in? Uh, all sorts, really um, active ones like darts and um, um, shooting, as in the clay things. And um, what else do I do? And I did That's the it. I've, pre I've given up my previously mentioned hobby, and I now take part in Olympic level synchronised swimming. Okay, thanks for that, Tom. We'll yeah, get to you diving. In a I do diving. I, I dive like Tom Daly. And, uh, do you think uh, Do you think the leisure is a luxury or necessity? Well, we don't know. Um, so we're going to say Cool. Well, let me just tell you the name. Okay, and Hannah. Oh, hey. And, oh, oh, oh hey, Patrick. Sorry. You're not meant to be there in two weeks. Oh, I see. Oh, I have no idea. Again the Zan, what do you do in your Again the Zan, what do you do in your Again the Zan, what do you do in your leisure time? Uh, I cook and clean and do the ironing. Do you stay in the kitchen often? Pretty much most of my life. Okay, cool. And how important is that to you in your life? Apparently quite so. Yeah, she doesn't do anything else, she's a woman. Right. My name is Mohammed and um, I was just wondering, what, what are you guys interested in, in terms of leisure? I'm quite interested in quite a few things. Yeah? Yeah, do you want to explain what? Uh, 
uh, well, in my free time, I like to play sports. And play guitar at the same time. Oh, right. So how, how important do you guys think that measure is for you? I think it's very important. Yeah. 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 Adam, speak. Um, Adam, what do you like to do in your leisure time? Um, play football, maybe. Is that it? And run. There's been rumours. There's been rumours about your, you know, vicious activities. Um, my lawyer suggested that I make no comment on this one. <laughs> I, I'm due back in court sometime next Friday. Um, but I'd just like to say nothing has been proven and um, I'm doing my best to take away the evidence of the small child. <laughs> we've got, we've got Pat to call again. Oh, hey boys. Oh, and Christopher Roberts. Chris, yeah? we're interested in what you do in your leisure time. What do you do? What do you like to do when you're not working? Um, I like to, you know, I like to play football and tennis and uh, I like to go to the gym. Yeah. Go for a run, yeah. a cycle. All good stuff, yeah. 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 Pretty much every sport. So how important do you find leisure in your uh, daily life? I find it very important to uh, relieve stress and, yeah, relieve those, you know. Do you like massages? Yeah. So I'm like totally heterosexual men. <laughs> what are your leisure activities? Well, um, I'm an international equestrian rider, actually. Um, I'm a professional ice skater. Oh, right. I'm really good at riding. Um, you don't do sport, it's fine. No. Um, so it's like 18 hours a day because I just think it's like really important to be really fit. So yeah, it's a waste right. of time. I can time. see so. It's, eating is probably better than sport, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, What's wrong with yeah. the race people? Like, because they're just like, you know, like, I like, look at you, you're like, your fat just goes everywhere, so I just think it's really good. <laughs> I know exactly what you mean. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. It's right. terrible. From the club, we've decided, oh, fuck. No. Oh my. Out of work and essential domestic activity, it's also the period of recreational and discretionary cre time. Uh, why is it? It's on the red bit now. Yes, that says it's recorded. <laughs> right.